So today we're going to run for a way where you can install any app onto your streaming device, whether it's your Fire Stick, Fire TV. This process can be used on Android TV as well, any device, and you can install anything. There's many apps out there, and you know, sometimes you might come and find a video on how to install it, or you might find an app and you think, how do I get that onto my Fire Stick? And I'm going to show you how to do it. Really simple, step by step, and we're going to take our time on this one. If you're brand new here, do remember to hit that subscribe button. We cover everything streaming. We've got tons of videos on whether it's watching football, whether it's your Fire Sticks, whether it's your other streaming devices, whether it's your apps, whether it's a VPN you may need. All on your device for you, okay? So hit that follow button, whichever platform you're watching on. And what we're going to do today, we're actually going to create codes for downloader. So I'm going to show you how to create your own codes. And then you can create your own codes, and I'm going to show you how to find the links, and then you can download any app, okay? So first things, we're going to put downloader on our device. So to get downloaded on the device, let me just uninstall this one. Right, so what we're going to do is go to our magnifying glass, type in here downloader. You'll see it underneath there, downloader. You'll click on that, and then we will click and install it, okay? Obviously, mine says download your own it. You don't pay for it. It's a free app, and I'll show you what downloader is for those who don't know it as well in a second. Right, that's installed, but let's not open it yet. Let's go to our home screen. Let's go across to our apps where it's three squares and a plus. Go to my apps, and we will find downloader right at the bottom. Once here, let me get out of the way. We're going to push the free line button on your remote, and we're going to ask to move it to the front. So we've got it up there so we can use it all the way through this video, okay? Brilliant. I'll come back. Right, we're going to get this downloader set up so it can install anything, and this will help anybody who maybe gets a pass error, things like that. So what you need to do is go to your settings, go to My Fire TV, and you need to go to Developer Options. If you do not have Developer Options here, click on where it says About, and click the one which is the name of your device seven times. Okay, then when you go back, you will have this Developer Options. Select the Developer Options, turn adb debugging on install unknown apps we're going to turn it on for downloader okay so that must be on right back to your home screen we're going to quickly open up downloader very important here that you accept this permission again behind my head accept this permission if you do not downloaded files will not be able to save onto your device so you click allow and you click ok right and that part's done so we've got the downloader ready we're going to ignore downloader for a minute. What we're going to do is create a code to put into this downloader so we can install anything. I'm going to create my code on my PC, on the internet. You can actually do it on mobile phones as well. It's not a problem. So what you're going to need is a website, which is go.aftvnews.com. Okay, you'll see it on the screen now. I've also, if you're watching this on YouTube, it's in the description and it's in the pinned comment for you as well. This website here is where we can make shortened URLs for the downloader app and more okay simple as that so we're going to make a short code ourselves so we're going to think of something we can do so we're going to search google and i'm going to search for mx player okay as an example mx player and we're going to download mx player but you need to make sure obviously the files you are downloading are good files so we're going to scroll down and find where there's an option of mx player up up to down download mx player right so we click it and we've got a download button here. I don't want to download it on my PC. I want to download it on my Fire Stick. So I'm going to copy the address at the top here. We're going to copy that. And then back in this short code, enter URL to shorten. We're going to paste it in there. We're going to click we're not a robot. And we're going to shorten it. And what you'll see, it's given us a code. 17081. Okay. So what we're going to do, I'm going to go back to my Fire Stick. I'm going to type in that code. 17081. Okay, and we're going to click go. And what you'll find that will do is load up the page we just had on the PC. So we now have a short code for our app. And you can do that with any app. Obviously, when you're installing apps, make sure the apps are safe, okay? You might want to run them via virus total or anything like that. Try and download from reputable sources, obviously my sites, other sites. 
So obviously watch out for advertisement because adverts are very tricky. It says start the download, but you can see at the top there it says advert. So we don't want that one. We want this green download button. We're going to click it. And that download is starting. OK, that's going to download for us now. Let me get out the way again. We can now click install. We then click done. And then you click delete because you don't need this file anymore. So you delete, delete that file. And when you go back to your home screen, if you go to the free squares and the plus, my apps, and right down the bottom, there is the app we've just installed. And that process can be used to install any app. OK, so you can use the website to create your own code. You can even type this URL in any way if you wanted to install that on a different device. You can go directly to the download as well if you want to. So you can copy the link of the download itself. So that process can work on any, everything. But obviously, the applications you are installing have to be compatible with your Fire TV device. OK, so if they're not compatible, then it's not going to work. So if you tried to get something like Sky Go, which doesn't work on a Fire Stick, it still won't work no matter where you install it from. OK, it's things like that. But this is a way if you find an app you want to try, you can create your own codes and you can install it. Obviously, I would recommend if you are installing applications from sources you don't know, make sure you've got your VPN turned on, whether you're on your PC or on your Fire Stick. I would recommend a great deal from IP Vanish at the moment. You're getting two years plus three months, okay, for the, one of their cheapest prices they ever offer, okay, at two forty nine a month, which is very cheap. That's linked underneath for you as well. I'd really recommend that if you're looking at installing other apps where you're not sure on the sources, things like that. We will be covering a video in the next few days on viruses on apps, or kind of malware on apps. So we'll be covering that on how to check on your Fire Stick and your other streaming devices as well. So that will all be on there. Brilliant. Remember, make sure you do subscribe to me on YouTube. Um, whatever platform you're watching this on, do check me out on YouTube. We have tons of content. Um, I'm currently, if you want shorter videos, we do have a TikTok at the moment as well. Is in the description as well. Our TikTok is flying at the moment. Loads of views, sort of one to two minute videos. So people like that shorter version rather than these long explanations. But again, that is your choice. Brilliant. So this is linked underneath this short code website from AFTV News. Brilliant site. All the rest of it's in the video. If you didn't quite understand it, just watch through again. Remember to hit the follow so there's other tips you can get. And I've been Doc Squiffy. Hopefully that one was helpful for you. And I'll see you soon.